So this is our second year in the Faculty of Education working with um, the Dot Art team. It's a project that's both um, exciting, innovative and allows schools to publicise and to show the art that the children and young people are creating. So we get involved in a lot of partnerships through the Faculty of Education. For us it's about supporting the development of schools in a range of different ways. We are in a fortunate position to have a range of resources, to have a range of opportunities for our students and we want to be able to extend those to, to partners. Dot Art Schools is an annual inter-schools art competition which is um, uh, open to schools across Liverpool City region and near neighbours. It's specifically for Year 5s and Year 9s to showcase and celebrate their artwork. The idea behind it is also to encourage young people to understand creative career pathways or at least get a taster of that and to boost their confidence and their resilience and also give them a chance to express themselves and enjoy that. Dot Art Schools came from a local secondary school who approached us asking if we could champion and support, showcase the work of local students in a similar way that we were supporting local artists. From there, it's developed into uh, an amazing programme that has so far worked with and engaged over 9,000 students and works with around 100 schools every year across the Liverpool City region. I like to express myself in different ways and this is probably my favourite way to do it. It always feels very nice to sit down and just draw what's on my mind. It takes a lot of my brain because I think about a lot of stuff. It inspired me to do more drawings and paintings, any form of art. Um, I learned that um, when I'm drawing, um, you can do your, your own thing. You don't have to do what everyone like, tells you to draw. You can like make your own imagination. But when we come to the point where we're planning the prize giving and the annual exhibition, that's when things get really exciting and fun. When I actually get to meet the young people who submitted the work, uh, who are the winners and runners-up um, and shortlisted children, there's nothing like that moment in my whole year. When we walk in the gallery and we see them arriving with their families and their teachers and the look of, of excitement and just pure pride on their face is brilliant. That's why I do the job, frankly. <laughs> <laughs> for that moment. I think it's important for the children to be involved in something that's not just school based. So I think in, they're all really eager to join in. Um, I think being involved in an organisation with dot art, like dot art is important because I think they can see naturally that as an artist, if it's your job, then your artwork is displayed and exhibited for other people to see. And I don't think children always relate that from what they learn as their experience in school. So I think Dot Art provides that for them. Yeah, my piece was called uh, A Mosaic Garden. And yeah, I really wanted to bring like bold, bright colors in because it was a very miserable time. People weren't um, feeling the best. But when I was doing my piece of artwork, I felt like very uplifted, motivated, determined. With all the bright colors, it just made me feel a lot, a lot better in that hard time. Uh, I, if it makes me feel proud because I can sort of do what I want with it and nobody really mocks it or anything. Yeah, because they can express themselves in it, they can express their moods and it sort of can make them feel a bit happier. We, f we feel the arts are, are very important as they're a big motivator for a lot of our pupils. Um, and art itself can be a, a vehicle for learning in that while they're actually enjoying the art, they'll be learning communication skills, problem solving skills, um, and hopefully develop skills and strategies that will help them um, when they leave here to be successful adults with autism. Absolutely recommend Dot Art for other schools. I think it's something that helps staff focus their teaching of art, helps pupils, um, yeah, I think it's a massively positive thing for the city.